Willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge äh, Sherlock Holmes Crimes and Punishment. Äh, ja, ich feiere das Spiel. Also die ersten, die erste Folge, ich muss sagen, grandios. Grafik echt. Boah. Und ja, ich will einfach noch weiter zocken. Ich habe jetzt kurz den Sound einstellen noch ein bisschen gespielt, dass es ein bisschen lauter für euch ist, dass man auch halt die Hintergrundgeräusche ein bisschen hört. Wie die Krähe, die gerade gekräht hat. Und die Fuß, das Fußstampfen. Boah. Und das ist mal eine Abwechslung zu den ganzen Horror Games. Okay. Da drinnen wird es blutig. Ja, den Garten. Hier gibt's Wasser. Da ist eine Schaufel. Aber hier hinten ist auch noch eine Hütte. Mr. Holmes. Oh, wow. Das? Warum steht hier ein Boot? Ja gut. Peter Carey's body is inside the cabin. We took care not to touch anything. Möchte auch sein. Mr. Holmes. The door is locked. Wait just a moment, Mr. Holmes, and I'll open it. I locked it yesterday to ensure that no one should enter the cabin and tamper with the evidence. Ah, good thinking. Hello, hello, hello. What is it, Lestrade? It seems to me that someone has tried to force it, Mr. Holmes. Let me see. Das These Kratzer. scratches are fresh. Mm -hmm. Interessant, interessant. You're right. Someone tried to force open the door. I swear these scratches were not here yesterday. Now a mysterious visitor came here last night. Well, he's not the man for the job. This lock is not a difficult one. <laughs> Perhaps he did not have the right tool. Na dann. Gehen wir mal rein. a terrible way to die. Later. This place is not covered with dust, like the rest of the shelf. An object was taken from here. It was larger than a book. A box or a small chest, perhaps. The tooth of a sperm whale, probably from one of Peter Carey's catches. Okay. Old navigation instruments, nothing interesting. Peter Carey's boots. They look to be a size eight. These boots don't match the footprints. Okay. Interessant, interessant. Okay. 
Harpoons for hunting whales. The Sea Unicorn. She was the ship that Peter Carey commanded. Zwei Gläser. The initials PC have been crudely burned. A sailor's work. Hmm, this aroma is familiar, but to recognize it, I must construct my associations in one picture. This is a coarse tobacco, quite strong and very popular among sailors. Someone drank from this glass recently. Someone drank from this glass recently. Rum, a sailor's drink. It seemed that Captain Carey was enjoying a drink before he met his death. This blood is from the pool underneath the dead body. This wooden handle is plain and solid. Peter Carey tried to defend himself with this knife, but he did not succeed. J.H.N. are probably the initials of the owner of this notebook. The pattern of the blood stain indicates that the notebook was not lying on the floor prior to the crime, but it was dropped into the pool of blood after the death of Peter Carey. Okay. These abbreviations mean something, but what? Beer. Habe ich Scheiße. Muss ich kurz. Wenn Sie zwei Hinweise finden, die miteinander in Verbindung stehen, entsteht daraus eine Herleitung. Rote Farbe zeigt an, dass die jeweiligen Hinweise nicht zusammenpassen. Okay. Okay. 
so. Heute gilt es sich auf die Dauer zu legen, um zu sehen, ob der Einbrecher einen weiteren Versuch wagen wird. Okay. Ha. Someone was here yesterday. They attempted to force the door to gain entry. Soll ein Versteck finden. Äh, aber wie, was, wann, wo, bitteschön? The weapon fully penetrated the body. The force of the blow was immense. This man is in his 50s, yet he still looks quite strong. Peter Carey was impaled to the wall by a wailing harpoon. Peter Carey was fully dressed. He was not caught by surprise. It is possible that he knew his murderer. Dann müssen wir nochmal zu der Troller da hoch. Ah, yeah. Is this your husband's tobacco pouch? I'm not sure. It might be. But he hadn't smoked in a very long time. Your husband's private papers. Do you know where they are? There was a small tin box, barely larger than a book. He kept his papers there. It should be somewhere in his cabin. Thank you, madam. It's bestimmt die Kiste die weg ist. Well, Mr. Holmes, what do you think? Now, I think that we are lucky. And why is that? Because of last night's attempted break-in. Oh, you've lost me. It is very probable that whoever came here hoped to find the door open. They tried to force it with a knife blade, but they failed. What will they do? Why, return tonight, when they will be better prepared. Aha! So what do you propose? We shall remain on the outside, near the window, where we stand the best chance of catching sight of our visitor. Well, gentlemen, ready your pistols. We have a long night ahead of us. Okay. Hmm. The ship's logs of the Sea Unicorn for the years 1878 to 1884. Peter Carey was her captain. Suchen Sie sich ein Versteck und untersuchen Sie den Mord auf Peter Carey. Also die Kiste ist auf jeden Fall nicht da. Gut, dann suchen wir uns ein Versteck. What the fuck? Wo 
Soll ich, was? Wo soll ich mich verstecken? So, dass sie sich ein versteckt, äh, Geheimnis für Einbrecher könnte... Äh, 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 wo soll ich mich verstecken, bitteschön? Das ist doch gerade ein bisschen... Hm. The ship's logs of the... This looks like the perfect hiding place. Gut. Dann legen wir uns auf die Lauer. Wie es weitergeht, erfahren wir in der nächsten Folge. Bis dann, bleibt gespannt. Genießt den Tag. Bye, bye.